10. Here comes a blitz. This time the throw in. Wildcats 50% on their third down conversions this year. They'll throw and first down toss to Lockett across midfield. Change at the line of scrimmage. Too many bodies inside. A nice check at the line of scrimmage by Colin Klein. Single coverage outside. And you can defend the option and test their discipline. Here it comes. And the pitch to Hubert. Got a nice block and cut it up to the 41 yard line. Trying to answer the 94 yard kickoff return for a touchdown. And a close but a yard in the fullback. And here's Colin Klein dropping back to throw again on third down. And overshot Travis Tannehill. Lead blocker. That's where Colin will go. Tries to bounce it outside and the Ducks equal to the task. Todd, not like Bill Snyder is a big riverboat gambler, but he goes on fourth yeah. and one. Well, and Kiko Alonzo, the inside linebacker, is who makes this play. Watch as he times it. He's going to actually knock the center and the fullback out of the play with his penetration. Colin Klein had nowhere to go with the football because Alonzo disrupted two blocks, stopped the timing of the play, and they got the fourth down stop. Wilson and Hubert with Klein in the backfield. Lock it in motion on first down. It'll be Hubert. And he found a crease. Tough run from the 19. He'll get it again. And a little bit short, I think. Three defensive linemen, now five defensive linemen in for Oregon to offset this Kansas State run game. Klein under center will give it off. Again, Hubert trying to bounce it outside. Did for a line. And he will throw. And throws it a little bit behind. This guy standing up right here like a linebacker is a defensive lineman. He's listed as the starting nose tackle, Ricky Himuli, and he's going to rush right over the center. Just a, a little different. But here on first and 15, they did get this play off. Klein scanning the field. Throws back near side. Oh, man. And in 15. Pressure coming off the corner, and Connor Klein will tuck this one away and get what he can, which is almost back tape at the Duck Six. Klein looking right, running now, heading to the corner in the pylon. Touchdown. Now they go to three wideouts. Second and goal at the three. And Connor Klein will try to do it himself. Barely got a yard. Whoop. Look out, almost a forearm thrown by Alonzo at the end of that play. It just didn't get enough push on the left side. And again, that was Nick Pitts who was in there, number 50, who got driven back and kind of disrupted the, the flow and the timing of the play. And that, that could have been a helmet-to-helmet, -helmet, yeah. not just a forearm. Yeah, well, here comes the forearm. I didn't uh, see the helmet-to-helmet -helmet the first time. That's two hits that this time. Tannehill, the tight end, is in the slot of the three to the top and here's the slant the other way and it is Harper but uh, forward progress right, Holly thanks for the 38 yard line first down Kansas State they need some offense pretty soon here this is Pease He's done a nice job running the ball but only got about three has been something that Oregon has really adhered to and uh, I think it's showing tonight Pease trying to go wide Defense not going to let him. Kiko Alonso again. And another loss. Colin Klein throws short. Lock it in and out of his hands. And it was Alonso again, the middle linebacker. The captain of the defense. Now these two inside linebackers, Alonzo and Clay, are very active. Alonzo a little bigger, fast, physical. Has a nose for the football, as you see right there. Gets that helmet right on the football and pops it out of Lockett's arms. The eight yard line. Pump fakes. Wanted to go long. Now he does go that way over to Harper. And ball was the ball out of the Tyler Lockett in motion toward the ball. The gives to Hubert. Cuts it outside, trying to follow his tight end Tannehill, and he got collared. Hubert's been good on this drive, and he's good again. Looks like he might have another first down. 
There's a road by the stadium with his name on it. He is Manhattan, Kansas to a lot of people, and he's done a wonderful job. Line of scrimmage and run your offense. And here he is trying to run to get back to the line of scrimmage, the original line of scrimmage, and can't get there. They came in number four. Now, depending on what goes on on Monday night, they could finish as high as second in the country in the final standings, depending on if Alabama was to beat Notre Dame. But if Notre Dame made it a two-point game or something, that might still be number one and number two. But Oregon still 